Hello. So someone on a 3D forum asked the uh, what's the difference between Mesh Smooth and Mesh Smooth and Turbo Smooth in uh, 3ds Max. So at first it doesn't look like much because both of them are subdivision modifiers. So I'll show you how you can. Uh, I mean, what's the difference between these two? So let's just uh, create a box. Uh, like this then we will convert it to editable poly my computer is running a lot slower today for some reason I don't know and uh, I'll just have it copied then on this one I'll add turbo smooth and not open circuit uh, turbo smooth there we go so something like this on this, I'll add Miss Smooth modifier and then I'll iterate it three times as well. Three and three. Right. I'll turn off isoline display. Uh, there you go. So both of them look exactly the same. Miss Smooth is a bit slower or a bit more RAM. Um, it, it uses a bit more RAM, RAM. RAM intensive is what was the word that I was not getting. So Mesh Smooth is RAM intensive. Turbo Smooth is not that much RAM intensive. And Open Subdiv, that's another uh, smoothing subdivision modifier. Uh, that's not at all RAM intensive because it uses uh, GPU power. So if I were to move it, delete this, add open subdiv to it, I can go to GPU display and have it rendered by GPU so it's not using CPU power while well, these two are. However, I already compared Turbo Smooth with uh, open subdiv, so I'll provide the link in the description for that. Another dis uh, another difference between uh, Mesh Smooth and Turbo Smooth is that Mesh Smooth has an option to be only applied to selected faces or edges for that matter. So if I select, if I deselect, apply to whole mesh, and I go back to Editable Poly and I select a face, let's say this one, and then without deselecting it, I go back to Mesh Smooth, you see it's only apply to the selected face and if I do the same to turbo smooth it will not work well it will still show you the selected face it will still be applied to the whole mesh another difference in this is just deselect this go back to much more another difference is the subdivision method so there are three one is classic which is the very old one and does not really do that well uh, then there's quad output oh, which is more or less the same but but instead of triangles on the corner it produces quads so and then there's norms which is more like turbo smooth but a bit different uh, i mean uh, the difference that I sh uh, showed you just right now is the difference between these two. So there you go. Mesh Smooth is an it is an older modifier, and it's not used as much. So that's it. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope it helped.